Hey, buddy, do you know where you're at? Well, just hang easy. I'm going to take your gloves off of you. Your other hand. Oh, man. Stay awake. Don't go to sleep. Do you know what happened to you? I said, do you know what happened to you? Okay. Well. They found you by the railroad tracks out of town. You weren't with that gang that hit that train, were you? I said you weren't with that gang that hit that train, were you? Okay. I don't know if I believe you or not yet, but here. I'm gonna take this, hey, hang on, I'm gonna take this gun belt off of you, okay? All right. Put that down on the ground. You mind if I take your firearm as well? Okay. Making sure it's empty. Okay. I'm sure you're in a lot of pain. Just hang on. <sighs> yeah, I think you took a bullet to the shoulder. Looks like you're losing a lot of blood. Here. Go ahead and take a sip of this. Good, good, good. All right. Just hang easy, hang easy. I gotta take a look at it. You definitely got hit in the shoulder. Were you in the train when they got robbed or? Okay, I'm just trying to figure out how you were found by the tracks. You sure you weren't with that gang that was riding? They robbed that train? Okay. All right, I'm not accusing you of anything. I'm just trying to get my facts straight here. Yeah, you got hit on the left shoulder over there. It's pretty, it's pretty bad. I won't sugarcoat it. We're gonna have to get that bullet out. Okay. We're gonna have to get that bullet out, okay? You're gonna sting a little bit. Okay. All right. Here, bite down on this piece of leather. Good. All right. Putting this on your shoulder now. It's just some alcohol. Yep. I know that hurts. We're almost done. Almost done. I just gotta make sure we don't get it infected. We don't want to get it infected. All right. 
Good, good. All right. So what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to get my tools out. We're gonna have to dig that bad boy out of there, all right? Okay. All right. It's gonna hurt, it's right about here. I'm sure you know, okay? All right. Keep biting down on that leather. All right. Hang tight. I have to really get in there, okay? Bite down on that leather. <laughs> yeah, I know that hurts. I'm sorry. putting yourself in harm's way like that, trying to save people, I know. I know you're trying to do the right thing, I guess, but no fun being shot. All right. I'm gonna have to get real close here, all right? Okay. I'm sorry. I know this hurts. I almost got it. Seems like it got it got lodged back. Okay, it's not it's not something I can't remove, but it's gonna take a little longer than I thought. All right. more of this danger and uh, you just drink as much as you can okay okay well I was looking at it and it looks like you got stuck up behind your muscle but if it stays there you might lose the arm so we gotta get it out yep just drink that up Good, good, good. Down the hatch, there you go. Yep, perfect. Good job. Good job, my friend. All right. Now I'm gonna have to get my knife out. All right. My fingers aren't gonna do it. I gotta get in there with the point, push down on that muscle, pry it up with that pair of pliers I got right there, and then I'm gonna dig in with my other pen over here, okay? And I should do it. It's gonna hurt a lot, okay? So, uh, you just keep biting on that leather, okay? All right. Bite down. I'll try not to take too long, all right? All right, yeah, I know that hurts. I know that hurts. We're gonna 
gonna be done before too long, I promise. I know, I'm sorry. You're doing a good job though, my friend. Not much longer. Almost got it. We almost got it. Just, just right there. Stay there. And hang tight. All right, there it is. And. Forty-five. Forty-five Colt. Okay. Keep that if you want to for a souvenir. off real quick. <laughs> Bleeding like a stuck pig. I'm gonna get some more of this alcohol on there, okay? It's gonna hurt, but we need to put it on there. Take another look at it. Yeah. I don't think it got through any nerves. Give me your hand real quick. All right, push down on my hand. Good, good. That, kid, that hurts a lot, okay. Just making sure you didn't have any nerve damage. I need to sew that up. Yeah. Well, if I don't, it's not gonna heal. No way. So I'm gonna give you a little more of this drink, okay? All right, there you go. 
Here you go. Drink up. Good. Okay. Now just turn, turn towards me, please, with that shoulder. Good. Just gonna sew it up for you. Doing a good job. You're not in too much pain anymore, are you? Good. I got a tincture of medicine I'm gonna send you back home with. I'm gonna give you something before we get out of here too. Did you get hit in the head at all by any of those guys whenever they hit the train? Okay. And we'll go ahead and look at that too then. I see a bruise up there, but I don't think it's anything too bad. So that's good. All right. Excuse me. A lot of blood. All right. Let's have one more look at it. Yeah, I think, I think you're gonna be okay. That was a close one. You were, you were, uh, not too, not looking too good when you first came in here. You feeling okay? All right. All right. You know, I got a tincture of medicine, all right? Okay. Let's get you to take a little sip of that real quick. Yep, just get a little mouthful. Not too much, though. Good. That's gonna get you feeling pretty woozy, all right? But it's gonna take a lot of that pain away. All right, now, you got a spot up there on the forehead. I'm gonna take a look at it, okay? It's a little bit bloody. I need to remove some of that blood off that caked off hair, okay? All right. too much but there's definitely some blood there all right now take a quick look at that forehead yeah I don't think that's not too bad at all that's just knotted up pretty good though Feel around, okay? You let me know if this hurts too bad, all right? How's that feel? Good, okay. I don't think they fractured it. 
Definitely got a knot on it. You're gonna wanna take it easy for a few days at least. Obviously with the shoulder, but also with the head injury. I don't want you overexerting yourself, trying to get back on your feet. All right, it's gonna take some time. All right, do me a quick favor, all right? Look here at my nose. Good, keep looking at my nose. Don't move your head at all. All right, follow my finger for me. Follow this finger for me. Yeah, keep your head still, just use your eyes. Good. Good. How many fingers am I holding up? Good. How about now? Good. All right. What I want to do is get these wounds wrapped up and treated, okay? All right. They want to get that saturated. Then I'm gonna put this one on your shoulder, okay? Right over them stitches. All right. Just like that, and you hold it there for me, okay? Good. All right, I'm gonna wrap it up. Just hold that on there for me. And you can go ahead and move your hand now. Yeah, go ahead and move your hand now. Glad we were able to get that out of there. That would have been bad. Bad, bad, bad. But you did a good, good job. I've seen many uh, folks pass out and just panic from the excruciating pain, but you held in there. And that helps me do my job, so I appreciate you. Thank you. All right. Tie that one off here. Good. How's that feel? Is that not too tight? Well, it's gonna hurt. You, uh, you got shot in the shoulder. Now, I do want to do a quick wrap on your head as well, okay? We're not going to need as much of the bandage this time, though. If I can rip it. Here we go. Sharpen my blades. All right. All right. Put this one on your forehead, okay? And just hold it there for me again, all right? All right, perfect. All right, about there. Yep, hold it there. 
good. You're lucky I went to town the other day and got more supplies. You would have been in trouble. Used a lot on you. Okay. I'm gonna wrap this around your own forehead now. Good. Over here on the right side. Good. And over here on the left side. Not too tight, is it? It's not too tight, is it? Okay. Good. You're doing a good job. That should do it. I'll go ahead and tie that off. Perfect. It's not too tight. Let me know. Okay. Good. Whew. All right. Okay. sure you weren't with those guys that robbed the train. Okay. Well, you seem like a nice enough person, so I believe you. I just had, I don't recognize you from the town, but if you were riding the train, that makes sense. Yeah. Where are you headed? Okay, well... I'm gonna have to insist you stay here, my office, or my house, for a couple of days at least, so I can keep an eye on your wounds. Those are serious wounds. Okay, sound good? All right. If you're headed to the line out west like you say you are, I'll write you a note so that they don't think you're telling a fib while you're late to the job. You're not going to be able to work in that condition, so you need to just relax for a few days. <sighs> All right. Well, I'll go ahead and turn the bath water on for you. And you can at least soak your legs and lower body. Go ahead and uh, take this with you, okay? All right, you're going to take a little sip before you go to sleep. When you wake up in the morning, you're going to take a little sleep or, or another sip. I'm not going to wake you up in the morning. You need to get your sleep and get your rest. Help your body recover, okay? All right. Well. Like I said, I'm, I'm just glad we were able to get to you, that's all. Shoulders looking okay, and that. That forehead's looking all right, too. Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna be okay. You're gonna, you should make a floor recovery. All right, my friend, well. Oh yeah, I'll let you when the bath water's ready. You just hang out here. There's some coffee over there in the kitchen if you can make your way over there and get you a glass. If not, that's fine too, but I'll let you know when that bath water's ready and I'll see you here in a minute, okay? All right, don't mention it. It's part of my job. They call me the doc. All right, see you in a minute. Bye now.